What's up guys, welcome back to HMHT. My name is Ben, your host of course. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can update your AirTag to the latest firmware update. So that's something that you can actually do. And these AirTag devices have build numbers and firmware version and from time to time these are going to be updated so apple has released a new firmware version and just in case you're curious this is just my air tag that you're seeing here and this is just like a belkin uh, air tag holder so i'll just leave it in the uh, air tag holder for now for the purposes of this video and show you how you can see the new version and build number that apple has released so in order to see the existing build number or firmware version that already exists on your air tag you can open up your find my application and go to where it says items so on the bottom of your iphone you see where it says items so make sure you select items click on your air tag and you can see your battery status of your air tag so if you click in way around here on the air tag you'll be able to see your serial number and also your firmware version so let's click there and see so for me you can see my serial number and also you can see my firmware version version so the firmware version that apple has released today is 1.0.0.2 276 initially when apple released the air tags or when they debuted the firmware version that was being shipped was actually 1.0.225 so you can see that from the release of the air tags up to now we have an updated firmware version however if you recently bought uh, like an air tag then you might already notice that it already has this firmware version 1.0.276 but there is an update to the build number of this firmware version so even though your air tag might have already this firmware version 1.0.276 it also needs to be updated to a new build number that came with this uh, new firmware version so the way you update your AirTag is actually very easy and very simple. So this is my AirTag that was connected to my backpack. You can see that we have some scratches here and this is just, you know, a strap, a Belkin strap that I used to connect it to the bag. So in order for me to update, I had to make sure that the AirTag was very close to the iPhone. So I just took it off. And the first thing that you actually need to do is that you need to make sure that your AirTag is very close to to the iPhone and if you have an air tag that you pl may be placed in the car then you need to remove that and bring it close to your iPhone or perhaps if you have an air tag that is on different luggage bags or in different places in the house just make sure that it's very close to your iPhone like this and what you want to do is basically just make sure that your iPhone is connected to the Wi-Fi or the internet and just leave it there for about 15 minutes after some time this is a process that is done in the background if you had the old firmware version that was 1.0.255 then you'll be able to see your firmware version updated to 1.0.276 and if you already had this new firmware version before attempting this 1.0.276 keep in mind that this firmware version came with an updated build number today and since the way you update air tags is very limited it's very similar to the way you update your airpods so there isn't a place where you can go and view the build number or manually update the build number so this is something that's done in the background so if your air tag already had this firmware version 1.0 276 then it also will be updated to the new build number that came with this firmware version in case you are curious the old build number that was there with this 1.0.276 firmware version was 1A276D and the new one that is now available is 1A2 87b so you can see that it's an update and the build numbers although it's the same firmware version the build numbers are different and the way you update is very easy and very simple to do if you bought an air tag long ago and have not updated it or perhaps you have the old firmware version that is 1.0 
dot two five five then you'll be able to see that your firmware version also is updated to depict the one that we have here so the update in case you are curious has to do with some audible alarms put in place to make it harder to stop people while using air tags so a little bit of a like an overall security update nothing major when it comes to this update now other than that that's how you do it you can see it's very easy very simple to do if you like this video please leave a like down below and stay safe and i'll definitely see you guys in the next video peace